What's up, guys? It's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Yellow walkthrough. Okay, so in our last episode, we went through, well, a bunch of battles. Got to teach a Pokemon TM or the HMO1. You know, grab a few items and all that crud. And now here we are in the rocket corner, about to turn this thing on, because, well, trouble's afoot. And, uh, well, we're gonna have some fun right here. It's a lot of battling, it's a lot of training. I mean, we do need the training because, well, these trainers, are, uh, these gym leaders are going to get a little stronger. Now, by this point, you guys should already have at least four to five Pokemon uh, in your team. Me, I did the whole thing by just, you know, getting them all at once because, you know, I, I, do, I do have initiative and all that crud. Okay, so here we go, taking on another rocket. Bring it. Just bring it. Okay, so here we go, Eradicate, looking like uh, it's about to attack me. Still faster than me, which is annoying, so here comes a Sleep Powder. Does not infect this guy? And, well, let's go with the Mega Drain. I don't want to, uh, I don't want to get beaten by this guy. So, here we go, Mega Drain. Takes a nice amount of HP right there, but I kind of want to do a Sleep Powder again. And here comes a Hyper Fang. Now, that is a powerful attack that Eradicate has. And just like that, we now have control over this battle, and, well, let's see. Let's go with the Mega Drain, and there it is. Yeah, who needs potions when you got Mega Drain? And yes, Eradicate is still asleep, so we we're actually working on this, uh, this thing right here, and another Mega Drain does it, and just like that. Okay, alrighty. So there we go, and just like that, Sir Razor is at level 24, so now he's going to be coming out with another Raticate. So let's go straight to Terramon and make sure that defense is working properly. Alrighty. Okay, Terramon, let's get it. Dig attack, and well, look at that Hyper, uh, Hyper Fang, not doing a lot of damage right there. So Terramon is actually doing great. There goes a dig attack, and just like that, Raticate has been defeated. And look at that. Oh yeah, we're kicking some butt, taking some names, everything else in between. Now there are gonna be a lot of items right here, guys, so make sure to keep some uh, some room. And well, there's an escape rope, which you guys already know. And well, I think I, I do have a Pokemon with Dig and all that stuff, so we don't really need an escape rope or anything like that. So let's go ahead and switch out the Pokemon. Let's go to Torpedo and see what it can do. All right, bring it on. Who are you? How did you get here? I do not know. Okay, so here we go, another rocket member with the whip, and coming out with a drowsy. Drowsies are kind of scary in a sense, and well, let's go with the bubble beam right here. The bubble beam gets it, and uh, that doesn't do much, and there comes a disable attack, and the bubble has been attacked, or disabled, which is great, so here we go again. And uh, that was a critical hit right there, so oh crud, a confusion attack doing its thing right there. So here goes another bubbly beam for the win and Drowsy has been defeated and there we go. More experience points for the rest of us. Torpedo is trying to learn Leer and this is a move that, well, you know, I kind of don't want to teach it so it's, yeah, it, it, we're good where we're at right there. Okay, so here comes a Machop. Easy pickets for Ultra Psycho right here. Okay, alrighty, let's do this. Machop, you buff. You buff AF, but here we go with a confusion attack. Let's see if this one works right here. And look at that. Say goodbye. Okay. Okay, so our Pokemon are doing pretty good right there. Not bad, not bad. Okay, so let's see if there's any other items right here. Nope, there's just an entryway. Let's go straight to another area right here. We're going to be going downstairs, and right here we're going to be finding a little bit more than usual, so let's go ahead and see what this guy's all about. Boss says you can see ghosts with a slow scope. You don't say. Now, my Pokemon right now, I kind of feel like they're a little under level just because, well, for the gym battle, because, well, about, I got six Pokemon right now. And it's not a bad thing, not a completely bad thing, it's just, you know, I would love to uh, be competitive against these guys. So here we go, Bubble Beam. And uh, we all know in Pokemon Yellow, the gym leaders from Koga, yeah, Koga and on, they get a lot stronger, and it's a little bit uh, scary because, well, crud. By that time, you should already be at, like, level 30 or so. 
or level 36. So that right there is another, you know, another thing that I, I have to keep an eye out for. So here we go. We're going to be switching out, coughing, looking like, well, coughing right here. And let's go straight for a confusion attack. Cannot wait to learn Psybeam because, well, it will do a lot more damage. And, well, just like that, defeated. And, well, he's coming out with Grimer. So let's continue on with Ultra Saga right here. Alrighty, okay, so we're taking some butt, taking some names. Good stuff, good stuff, good stuff right there. And well, there's more points, and Ultra Psycho grows to level 25, which is great. And here comes a Zubat, so let's go ahead and switch out to Aaliyah right now. Huh. Is there anything else that I need to talk about right here? Well, let's see. Huh. We've got a lot of dungeons. Dungeons and Dragons, I don't know, I've never played that shit before. <laughs> And, well, let's see, here we go, another Raticate. So let's go right ahead and go with Terramon. Hmm. I think, uh, I did, I did look up onto a retrospect of this game, and one of the biggest complaints about this whole game was that, well, yeah. It, a lot of, uh, a lot of routes, a lot of dungeons, longer, it, they're just long, and it just, sometimes it gets a little frustrating, which I do agree with, because, well, you know, how many trainers do you really need? Have they thought about, you know, rematches and all that stuff? I don't know. Alright, let's move on right here. And yes, we are getting a lot... Well, we're getting dizzy. I wonder if, uh... I wonder if Pikachu has that graphic for being dizzy or something. I don't know. Okay, so... Let's go right ahead and grab, grab ourselves some items right here. Who loves items? And, well, we found ourselves another Moonstone. And remember, in the Pokemon Red, Blue, Yellow versions, you can actually get all the, all, well, enough Moonstones for all the Pokemon that need to be evolved by a Moonstone. And, well, let's grab this. Found ourselves a Nugget, which can be used for extra money. And, well, let's go right here. We don't want to get dizzy right now. You gotta love the theme song right here. You really do. Okay, so let's go right here. And we got ourselves a TM07. Let's see, what was TM07? Was it was it Horn Drill? I think it was. Let's see. And yes, it is Horn Drill. Now, Horn Drill is a one-hit KO move. Very inaccurate. And uh, well, we're not going to be using that for quite some time or ever. So we're going to go right here, and we're going to keep on grabbing some items. You know, who doesn't love items? I love items. And well, here we are right here. I wonder if in real life it would be just like this where we're just going to be dizzy or it would be a dizzying uh, thing. And well, let's see. I think there's an item right there, so I'm going to skip ahead and see. Let's see. Oh yeah, there is another item right there, but how are we going to get there? Oh, guess. Right here. Let's go. And... Okay, so let's go ahead and grab this one right here. And we have found ourselves a super potion. And, well, now... Now we're going to have to go right here and... Yeah, we're going to have to probably start all over. Kind of. Just a little bit. And, well, let's see. Right around here. And right here. Okay, so... This is at the end we actually have to go into another room to actually get a key card and well hopefully I have enough room for, for all the items right here I think we picked up like about six items already and you know in generation one that's a lot of items for one for one little bag right here okay so let's go right over here obviously there is a there's an elevator that you can't use right now and well you're gonna be finding another trainer okay so, let's go right ahead and battle again. Alrighty, so here we have another trainer, a rocket. He's the next victim in this whole battle, and well, here comes Torpedo. And I think Torpedo evolves later on in level 30, so we're just gonna... We're gonna have to limit the amount of uh, battles it has right now, but then, you know, eventually, once we get into Seedra, then it's gonna be powerful AF. We get to teach us some pretty good moves as well. And, well, here it comes Raticate, so we need to go straight to Terramon. And, well, Terramon is ready to go. Let's get it, Terramon. Let's get this uh, Dig Attack right here. And, well, Dig Attack, will it do it? And there we go, Dig Attack for the win. 
and that Raticate has been defeated. Now, my question is, how in the heck did you get a level 19 uh, Raticate? That's my question right there. So, let's go straight for a dig. Of course, a Hyper Fang. It's not going to be super effective. Man, I am so glad I got Terramon to evolve. It's pretty awesome. It's very, very awesome. So, there we go. Dig attack for the win. And, well... Here comes a Rattata. So this is easy pickets for another Pokemon. Let's go straight to Sir Razor. Now, I think I figured out why Sir Razor's nickname goes from Sir Razor to Sir. It's very simple. Um, it's in the trading process when I go into Pokemon Snap or in Pokemon Stadium, and that is that. Well, I think I think that's the reason because it, there's less spaces to name your Pokemon in Pokemon Stadium than right here. So. Yeah, I think that's the reason why that happens. And, well, there's another item right there. Found ourselves a Hyper Potion. And there is another trainer right here. So let's go right ahead and switch out our Pokemon. Let's go straight to Aaliyah. Aaliyah needs some, uh, some destruction right here. So here we go. Intruder Alert! And it looks like we have ourselves an Alarm. Okay, so here we go, guys. We're taking on a rocket, and he's coming out with a Grimer. Okay. Alrighty. Dump truck. I need to find you, and I need to train you. Again, thinking of all the Pokemon that I can be using, and I can actually use for Pokemon Stadium later on. And, well, here comes a coughing. So, let's go right ahead and use Godzilla, Godzilla. Now, I kind of feel like Godzilla, Godzilla is being a little unloved as of lately. Usually, at this point, it should already be at level 30. Right now... Let's go for a Dragon Rage attack, and that right there nearly makes his Pokemon faint, and that Smog attack is no good. Yes, let's use Godzilla Godzilla to its fullest extent right here. Look at that, level 24. And it's trying to learn Rage. Wow, already? Okay, so let's go ahead and take away Leer, because we don't really need that. Okay, alrighty. Look at that, Rage attack. And here comes a coughing. Godzilla fears no Pokemon right here. So let's go straight for another Dragon Rage. Yeah, buddy. Now, I actually thought that, you know, uh, Flamethrower was a was a TM at some point right here. But, there, you know, again, I'm one too many generations ahead of time. So, yeah. I was going to teach Godzilla a much more powerful Fire-type move. But that wasn't going to work. I wasn't going to teach it fire, uh, fire Blast or anything because it's so inaccurate. And, well, let's see. Let's go... Okay, now we have to get out right here. And... Alrighty. Okay, so now we gotta go downstairs even more. Because we still have to find a key. And, well... Yeah, we're gonna be searched upon by this guy right here. We got word from upstairs that you were coming. Yeah, down say. And... Okay, so here we go. Taking on another matchup. You gotta love that. Okay, Thunderbolt. Finish him. Okay, alrighty, alrighty. And just like that. Yeah, buddy, okay. And Aaliyah's just kicking some butt, taking some names. So now we're gonna to go with Godzilla Godzilla because Godzilla loves us. We gotta give it a little bit more love. We have to try and evolve Godzilla into Charizard by the time we get to the last or to the fourth gym. Don't 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 necessarily think that that's gonna happen, but we'll see what happens right here. So let's go Ember Attack. And just like that, a critical hit. And look at that. Another rocket has been defeated. Yes, we are taking these guys down one by one. Bring it! Just bring it. And there is another item right here. What is it? And we found ourselves the TM10. And let's see what we got. Let's see what we got here, guys. TM10. It is double edge. Okay, so let's go ahead and teach it to one of the one of our Pokemon right here. Uh, you know what? Let's see. Hold on. I think you can actually buy TM10. Let's see. Hold on. Let's go ahead and. Uh, okay, Ali is not one of those Pokemon, but if I could teach it to Godzilla. Probably. Torpedo. Yeah, its physical attack is not going to be good. It's more of a special attacker. Now, God, now, Sir Razor can actually learn it. Its attack is pretty good. Terramon has a way better attack. And, uh... 
No, it, has, it actually has a pretty good attack. Okay, so... Holy crud. This is all up in the air right here. You know what? I could teach it... I could give it to Sir Razor right here. Yeah, because... Let's see. Vine Whip... No, actually, we're, 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 we're cool with the attacks we have right now. I am not trying to rush ahead. I could give it to Godzilla Godzilla for the time being. You know what? That sounds like a very good idea right now, okay? Godzilla looks like it needs a better a better attack. I get that it just learned Rage, but Rage is not really going to do me anything when it keeps on increasing its attack when it gets hit. So let's go right ahead and take away Rage. And there we go. Alrighty, so let's go right ahead and go straight right here. And I believe there's an item. I believe there's a rare candy around here somewhere. Like right there. Oh, okay. Look at that. Okay, so let's go ahead and grab this. Found ourselves a rare candy. We're gonna wait on that for just a little bit because I got plans. Lots and lots of plans. And oh yeah, we are in Celadon City. I completely forgot about something. We can evolve. We can evolve uh, Sir Razor if we wanted to right now. And then the rest, you, we could, you could just teach its moves like later on. <laughs> Sounds appealing. Sounds very appealing. Okay, so let's see. Let's go ahead and switch out our Pokemon to our other favorite Pokemon right here. And there we go, another Team Rocket member. Stop meddling in Team Rocket's affairs. Holy crap, holy crap, here we go. Alrighty, so here we go, another Team Rocket member wanting to battle us, and he's coming out with his Radita. But here comes Godzilla Godzilla. Let's go with that double-edge attack right here. Okay, look at that. Oh, nearly defeats it. Now, there is the chance of a recoil, and for that to happen. And, wow, nearly defeated. Let's go with a scratch attack right here, and luckily for us, we do have revive, so everything's gonna be alright. And it grew to level 25, which is great. Now, let's go straight to Terramon. And... Alrighty, okay, so here we go, Terramon wanting to take a... Well, get a piece of this Pokemon right here. And there's that Mega Punch right there, and... That doesn't work, are you serious? Holy bejeebus, okay, so Hyper Fang is, uh, is another thing right there. It's still not working. I'm actually very, very glad I have Terramon, but I kind of want to teach it a fighting type move next time. So let's go Mega Punch. And just like that, Mega Punch does it. And here comes a Drowsy. So let's go ahead and switch out to our Aaliyah right here. Okay, alrighty. So let's go. Let's go with a Thunderbolt attack right here. Let's go with a Thunderbolt attack. And the pound attack right here is not working, so let's go ahead and try it again. Okay, alrighty, so there you go. And just like that, Draven has defeated another rocket. So you gotta calm down, homeboy. So what, do, what, do you, what does he have? So let's go, the machine, the, uh, the boss stole, it's here somewhere. Better be here somewhere. Okay, so let's go right ahead and go downstairs. Now, this is fourth floor, and this is where you're going to be able to find one of the items. Now, before we do anything, let's go ahead and heal up our Pokemon, because, you know, healing up your Pokemon is the right thing to do. And, well, let's see. Let's go again. Now, I wish we could, like, I wish the healing process could have been just like in the Pokemon uh, Black and White, too. That's a, that, you know, it could actually help out right there. So there we go. Sir so Razor's healed. And Terramon's gonna be healed. And, well, let's go ahead one more and heal Leo. Okay, so all my Pokemon are healed. And one thing, one more thing, one more thing, and that is let's give this rare candy to Godzilla. So now it's up to par. Now we're getting somewhere. And, well, let's see, let's see. Uh, yeah, there's another, there's, there are other things too. Okay, so let's go right ahead and start grabbing some more items. And it's probably a good thing that we got rid of that rare candy. So here we have an HP up, which I can actually use to sell. And, well, let's see. There is a trainer right here, but before we go there, let's go ahead and grab this. And yes, we have no more room for items. Gravy. Okay, so 
Let's see. You know what? We can get rid of this. Toss this little sucker. Since we don't really need it. And let's go ahead and grab this. We found ourselves the TMO2, which is a... I'm hoping it's a good move. Let's see. And yes, it's Razor Wind, which can actually work for, you know, one of these Pokemon. Well, a flying type Pokemon, I believe. And yes, it doesn't work for any of these guys now. So, let's see. Yeah, before we battle this guy, because we have like three, three or four more items to do, I'll be right back. I got the dig technique, guys. I'll be right back. I need to empty out this whole thing right here. I'll be right back. Again. Okay, so here we are back, guys. We, uh, <laughs> we had to release a few things. Alright, let's go right ahead and defeat this guy, because we got a lot more stuff to actually grab. The elevator doesn't work! Who has the lift key? Gee, I don't know. Maybe the guy who's emphasizing the lift key or anything. Okay, so here we go, taking on another rocket, and he's gonna be coming out with his coughing right here, and, well, Godzilla Godzilla is ready to destroy, so let's go straight for a Dragon Rage attack. And, well, look at that. Dragon Rage nearly defeats Godzilla, or coughing. And, yes, thankfully we didn't get, uh, yeah, thankfully we didn't get uh, poisoned or anything like that. So there it is. And, look at that. Okay, more experience points for all of us. Here comes a Zubat. So let's go straight to Ultra Psycho and just defeat him. Defeat him like usual right here. Here, co here comes Ultra Psycho. And, well, here we go. Confusion attack for the win. And just like that, Zubat has been defeated, and, well, Draven has defeated the Rocket. He's like, no! Okay, what do you got? got? And he's like, oh no, I dropped the lift key! Yoink! Okay, let's go right ahead and uh, use that elevator now, because we, uh, we are very close right here. So let's go straight up here, and let's do it. Let's get out of here. Let's save the Pokemon world. Or just this casino, whatever. I don't know. Would you guys consider this a, a casino or a playroom? I don't know. And, well, let's see. Come on, man. Like, back then, it would be a lot easier just to use the, the, the speed button. But I can't because I kind of promised not to do so. Especially in the main footage. And, well, let's go right here. And just like that. Let's go right ahead and... Man, we are, like, we could be a dizzy. Very, very dizzy. Super dizzy, I don't even know. So let's go right here. And... Let's see, right here. And just like that, finally, okay. All right, I'm gonna need to throw up a little bit, just a little bit later on. And let's go here. And first things first, let's go to bottom floor number one, because there's gonna be an exit way you can actually get to after you defeat Giovanni and it's right here bring it are you lost you little rat okay first of all that's mean okay why would you call me a little rat that's kind of a, a mean thing to say anywho team rocket member wants to fight and he's coming out with a dump truck I mean <laughs> Grimer and well let's go right ahead and use another another dragon rage right here and just like that, we're taking a we're, we're we're taking a lot of HP. So let's go straight for the Ember attack right here. And well, there you go. Not bad, not bad at all. Okay, so there we go, another Ember attack. See, this is the reason why Flamethrower needs to, needed to be learned just a little bit earlier than anything. Okay, and well. Let's see, let's see. Alrighty, so we defeated that guy, and here comes a coughing. So let's go straight to Ultra Psycho. And, well, Ultra Psycho is ready to go right here. And let's go straight for a Confusion Attack. And just like that, okay. Defeated. And another Team Rocket member has been defeated. He's like, why? Well, because of that... Uh-oh, that fight opened the door! He did. Okay, so that's that, and I want to say bottom floor four? Probably? I don't know. Let's see. Ah, yes. Not another step, brat! Oh, completely forgot about these guys. How dare you humiliate us at Mount Moon? It's payback time, you brat! Huh. 
Okay. So, we're taking on Team Rocket yet again, and it's double trouble. Now, they still have Coughing and Grimer. Let's go right ahead and just, uh, well, let's, let's have our way with these Pokemon right here. Godzilla is feeling a lot stronger. It looks like it has a horn on its back, but really it isn't. And here comes a Smog Attack. That really could do us. And yes, it did us because it, yeah, we have a poison Pokemon right here. Jeebus criminy. Okay, so let's go straight for a double edge attack. And just like that, coughing has been defeated. Luckily for us, no poison. No poison effect in Generation 1. So let's go ahead and switch out to our next Pokemon right here, Terramon. Let's get it. Alrighty, Terramon. Bring it. Terramon. Let's go with a dig attack. I like dig attack right here. And just like that. Okay. I got bitten. So here we go. Dig attack for the win. Okay, alrighty. And well, here comes an Ekin. So I'm just going to continue on right here. And let's go straight for another dig attack. Let's see what happens. And here comes dig attack for the win. And just like that, another Ekans has been defeated. And Terramon has grown to level 29, which is great. And he's trying to learn Harden, which, uh, well, at this point, is not, it really isn't needed. So there we go. Harden defeated. And, well, there it is, guys. Okay, alrighty. A dreadful twerp. And, uh, looks like Team Rocket is blasting off again, which it is. Okay. So that was easy. That actually replaces the two trainers that were supposed to be there. And, well, let's go ahead and heal up our Pokemon right now because, you know, gotta gotta make sure that they're uh, nice and uh, nice and ready. And, well, let's... Hold on just a sec. All right, let's go do that. And there is an item right here. And right there we found ourselves an iron, which can actually be used for to heighten up the defenses. Now, let's go right ahead and... Switch out the Pokemon right here. Now, I think I'm going to go straight for Sir Razor. Mainly because he's, uh, this guy has a lot of ground type Pokemon. And, well, there's the boss himself. So, I must say, I am impressed you got here. Alrighty. Let's go. And here's the boss himself. Giovanni wants the battle, and he will be coming out with an Onyx. I picked correctly. Holy crud, I picked correctly. And, well, let's go straight for a Vine Whip, and this Rock Throw is not going to work, so here we go again, Vine Whip. And there we go, Onyx has been defeated. Sir Razor kicking butt, taking names, and, well, here comes a Rhyhorn, so let's continue on with Sir Razor. And do this, the Vine Whip attack for the win. And just like that, Rhyhorn has been defeated. And look at this, a level 25 Pokemon. And let's see, Persian will be coming up next. This Pokemon is no good. This Pokemon, well, it's not, it's, it's trouble. It does have speed on you and it does like to use its Screech attack. Normal type Pokemon, meet your maker, Terramon right here. Yes, Terramon's defense will stop you. And well, oh God, payday attack, holy crud. That's extra money for us, by the way. And, well, let's go again. Another dig hole, a hole. And he's going to be using a guard spec, which doesn't really make any sense. And just like that, Persian has been defeated. And Giovanni's like, what? This cannot be. Yes, it can be. I see that you raise your Pokemon with the utmost care. A child like you would never understand what I hope to achieve. I shall step aside this time. I hope we meet again. And just like that... We grab ourselves a self scope, and you know what? We could go through the exit, but nah, you know what? We got dig attack. Let's go ahead and do that. Yeah, buddy. Dig attack. Better than an escape rope, and just like that, guys, we are back at the Pokemon Center. So, here it is, guys. In the next episode, we will be going back to Lavender Town, and we're gonna be, uh, well, we're gonna be figuring out this whole mystery of the ghost Pokemon right there. So stay tuned for all of that. Make sure to subscribe. Make sure to hit that notification button, guys. It will help me right here. And, well, if you guys want to make a small donation to this channel, the link is in the description right there below. I will be back for another episode of Pokemon Yellow. See you guys.